by me? Enough! You cannot hide! Recently, we've been blessed with new hero gameplay from Battlefront 2. Each of these videos showcases a different hero, so far I felt there was more to this footage than just the hero, so I'm gonna do a short breakdown. The beginning of the Darth Vader clip, Galactic Assault on Endor I'm guessing. We see an armour for this troop over here. This armour looks very much like the Imperial Jump Troopers seen in the Rebels TV show. They used burst shields and carried the RT-97C Heavy Blaster. Not sure if that shield thingy will be an ability. I think it will follow the same setup as a clone Jump Trooper. Why? Because we see them use the jump pack with the rocket launcher at the end of Vader's clip. So I'm guessing it's pretty much the same. This part also shows us that they are in fact holding the RT-97C blaster. So I guess it's safe to say that these are the Imperial Jump Troopers set in the original trilogy. We got told about Vader's abilities, Saber Throw, Force Choke and Focus Rage. Force Choke now affects multiple targets, and his Saber Throw now passes through the enemy, just like Darth Maul's. You can tell both resistance troops are taken down by the Saber Throw because you can hear two kill sounds in the clip. You defy me? Enough! Focus Rage increases his damage and to be able to withstand more damage, so it's basically he gets more damage to take less damage. So the question is, does this damage buff affect his abilities? I'm guessing it does, since his choke and saber throw were both instant kills. Judging by how heroes are designed and Darth Maul, abilities don't seem to be a one hit kill. So I'm guessing focus rage will affect Vader's abilities to make them a one-shot kill, which uh, does actually make Vader a lot more intimidating. This shot of Jakku paired with Ray's experience on Jakku kind of gives us an idea of how the map works based on its description. The Resistance will have to push through the Star Destroyer interior to escape the First Order, and once they get out then uh, they just continuously have to push the First Order back. So we get an idea of how the indoor and outdoor portions will look. So that's a really cool shot. And most recently, Aiden was confirmed as a multiplayer hero. Something I made a video on a while ago actually, so I'm glad it actually happened. Yeah, Aiden looks great. The pulse cannon seems to work the same, where you have to charge it up. The levels indicate for how long. This specialist barely had any health, so I'm guessing that's why it wasn't charged up fully. The droid seems to have a pretty decent range on it, and Aiden gets a personal shield. So I think Aiden is an all-round well-made hero and has traits for every situation. I can see her being one of my favourites already. Ray's footage shows a Twi'lek on Takadana and Aiden's shows one on Yavin 4. So it kind of gives us the impression you can use these alien skins from the first Battlefront will pretty much be available in each era. So maybe if you unlocked an alien race skin you can pretty much use it whenever you want. Both Bosk and Lando have been briefly seen in the menu screens of these short hero showcase videos. Lando is wearing his general outfit this time round, which is a new addition. Hopefully the Bestman skin will also be there so there's more variety among heroes. So yeah, Bosk and Lando are now playable in multiplayer. Hopefully we'll get some showcases of those two soon. Now that the beta's over, you guys may have some questions about the game. If you have any feedback or suggestions for the game, let me know either in the comments or over on Twitter. I'll do my best to answer them and hopefully pass it on to the developers. The team recently wrote a statement on the negative parts on the beta, like the crates and the progression, so they just wanted to reassure everyone that the problems are being looked into. So if you want to read through that, there's a link in the description. But as for now, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's been River and I'll see you in the next video.